Task 1.5 Add Debtor and Creditors Account In this task, you will learn how to create a new debtor and creditor. We assume we know you have any accounts of our customer and supplier. There's a three methods for you to create your customers or your supplier. First, either you go to AR, Debtor Maintenance. Second, either you go to the Customer Shortcut and choose for Debtors or you may go to your to my favorite shortcut under debtors or also creditors under debtors and creditors you will see two different icon if you click on the picture icon it will bring you to the customer information detail which you can straightforward create for your new customer or supplier if you click on the debtors or creditors listing it will bring you to the debtors or creditors layout which you can see how many debtors or creditors that you already created first we create debtor go to the ar debtor maintenance and create a new debtor the first debtors we want to create is customer one after you enter the company name then click the plus sign under debtors account the debtors account will be automatic generate based on the control account combination with the company name. Then enter the billing address. The billing address is 1 Jalan 1 Banda 1 Malaysia. You may choose either you want to enter your billing address in one column or separate column. Once you're done, before you click on save, if you still have other debtors you want to create, you may choose to click after save action at the bottom. So that once you click on save, the screen will remain on the new screen and the debtors one will be saved at the back. Once you click on save, proceed with customer 2. Enter the company name customer 2. Then click the debtors, click the plus sign of the debtors account. After that, enter the billing address 2 Jalan 2 Bandar 2 Malaysia and click on Save. And the last one, debtor's company name is Customer 3. Then click the plus sign to generate the debtor's account. After that, enter the billing address. 3 Jalan 3 Banda 3 Malaysia Before you click on save you may choose to untick after save action then save After you done create all the customers your layout will appear with the empty column To remove the empty column you click your cursor on the name hold your mouse Drag until you see the X button, then remove your mouse. Do the same for other empty column. To bring out the address column, put your cursor on the header, then right click. Select column chooser. The customization box will appear and you may insert the address column based on numbers of column that you enter the address in your customer detail just now. If you amend on the column under debtors and creditors maintenance, you have to save the layout. If you don't save the layout, once you exit and you come back to the debtors or creditors maintenance, if you didn't save the layouts, once you exit and you come back under debtors or creditors maintenance, all the empty column will be remain back and the address column will disappear. To save the layout, right click on the header, then choose save layout. You may enter any of the layout names you want to save. For example, Adapters Layout 1 
If you wish to print your debtors listing, you may click on Print grid to print under AutoCAM format or you may export to any format as you wish. Done for debtors, now we continue with creditors account. To create for the creditors, you have to go to AP, Creditors Maintenance, then create a new creditor. The first supplier name is Supplier A. Once you're done, click the plus sign to create to generate the creditors account. Then enter the billing address. The billing address for supplier A is A, Jalan A, Bandar A, Malaysia. And before you save, please click on after save action, proceed with new creditor as we still have other two creditors we need to create. Then click on save. The second creditor is supplier B. Then click the plus sign to generate the creditor's account. Enter the billing address. Then click save. And the last creditor is supplier C. Click the plus sign again to generate the creditor's account. Then enter supplier C billing address, which is C, Jalan C, Bandar C, Malaysia. And before you want to save, please untick after save action again. Then save. Similar like what we did in debtors, you have to throw away all the empty column. To throw away, just click, drag and release your mouse. For all the empties column then we need to bring out the address column to bring out the address column you have to put your cursor on the header then right click select column chooser then customization box will appear bring out the address column and again you have to save this layout by right click and choose save layout you may save the layout's name by putting the layout's name of Creditors Layout 1 and save. Done task 1.5.